Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you 5 easy ways to fix Valorant not updating in Windows 11 in no time. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to simply update Windows. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on Windows Update on the left pane and then on the right side click on the Check for Updates button. Now Windows will scan for the latest updates and if it finds any it will download and install them automatically. Afterwards you can just restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to allow Valorant through the firewall. To do this, press the Windows button, then type in Firewall and then make sure to select Windows Defender Firewall from the search results. Now in here on the left pane click on Allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall and the next move is to simply add this app in this following list. So click on Change Settings in order to add the app and then click on Allow another app button. From here on we have to find the default location of the game. So click on browse and then make sure to click on the C drive if you installed it by default in the C drive, select the Riot Games folder and then click on the Valorant folder, double click on live, then open the shooter game folder, go to the binaries, Win64 or depending on your system architecture and then click on the Valorant game. Now press on open and as you can see the Valorant game shows up in the app list. Click on add and then what you have to do lastly is tick the box under private and public to allow this game to the firewall. Now click on OK to save the changes, restart your computer and check if now Valorant can update. Otherwise the next move would be to repair the Valorant game files. Maybe the game has been corrupted recently and then it cannot update properly. So what we have to do is open the Riot client and then make sure to click on the profile icon in the top right corner of this application and select the settings option. Now in here on the left pane click on Valorant and as you can see you have a big button that says repair. Now click on the repair button and if the client detects any corrupted files it will automatically update them and fix them. But in case your game is fine then you'll just get this default message that says that your game is up to date. After the reparation process is finished you can just restart your computer and then check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to allow Valorant to run as an administrator. This is super simple, what you have to do is on your desktop, right click on the Valorant app and then select the run as administrator option. From here on you can check if the game will update properly and if not there will be a last resort as a solution to uninstall and reinstall the Valorant game. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon and afterwards click on apps on the left pane and then on the right side click on installed apps. Now in the search apps box simply type Valorant and as you can see we have the Valorant game which was found. Click on the ellipsis next to it and afterwards select the uninstall option. And after uninstalling Valorant simply reinstall the game, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. However, as an alternative, we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time, Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware, which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it. Super simple, isn't it? As usual, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.